Okay, I'm about to make my secret spices concoction. So, I don't want anybody to tell anybody about this. Okay? Except for these ingredients right here. These are fine. You guys can talk about it. But those stuff in here. Shh. Don't tell anyone. All right. My first ingredient. Onion powder. This is one of the secrets I can share with you. The onion powder. Boy in there. My second is garlic powder. Oh yeah, that bad boy in there, beautiful. My next one, ground cumin. I put this bad boy in there. Gotta break the seal. Get in there. Release it. There we go. And I use fine Himalayan pink sea salt. Got to break the seal. I put in usually two tablespoons, okay? That's that. I put in a little bit of this um, parsley here. See, it's dry parsley, parsley flakes, whatever. Just a little bit. I just probably about that much. It wasn't a lot. You guys can see that. And another super secret. Dun dun da. Dun. What I got in this, guys? Should I tell you guys what it is? I don't know. Okay, I'll let you in. This is sugar. That that pure cane. That that pure cane sugar. I put two tablespoons of this in here too. Yep. Oh, I don't know if you guys are wondering. You guys can see this back here. This is white jasmine rice. This is black rice. And this over here is brown rice. So what these three jars are. If you guys were wondering what those were back there. And what I usually do with this mix, I usually use it like as a dry rub or seasoning up my um my roast. You know, that's usually what I use it for. And I don't I don't blend it. Usually people put these in food processors, blend them up. I just shake it around, I hand shake it. But you can you can use a food processor and blend it up if you want. But I I like to you know, do it by hand. I'm just used to doing it like this. So, you guys can use a food processor, blend all the seasonings up if you want to. And yeah, I usually use it for my for my dry rubs, on my roasts, my steaks. You know, anything to give a little flavor, you know, to whatever I'm preparing at that time. But, I gave you guys most of the ingredients. There was three I left out. You guys got to figure that out yourselves. <laughs> I can't give you 100% my secret ingredient. Because it, it took trial and error for me to find this. So, you guys are going to have to find the rest out yourself if you want to go deep into it but that's the ingredients I give you 
are pretty good you know they add a lot of flavor to your food so even without the three secret ingredients that I use in mine it's still a, a great um, seasoning and that's what it looks like guys it looks uh, I'd say kind of kind of brownish yellow a little bit but you guys want to use a dry rub or you guys want to just use it to add a little flavor to your steak chicken whatever you're cooking that's my secret recipe well almost you guys gotta figure out the rest of it if you want my total secret but guys use that add a little flavor and uh if any of you try it you can comment below about if you like it or not and if you do please subscribe thumbs up or thumbs down okay alright guys